Hi, I'm Emmett from Camino Ways and Francigena Ways. Are you a wine lover? Head on an incredible wine tasting adventure with CaminoWays.com, the walk and holiday specialist, to follow our nine Camino Ways for wine lovers. Autumn is the time for wine harvesting in Europe, and the Camino de Santiago and the Via Francigena trails take walkers through some of the most important wine producing regions in France, Spain, Portugal, Italy, and Switzerland. September and October are the ideal months to visit these beautiful wine producing regions to experience the tradition and culture of the harvest season. So the following are nine of the Camino routes which are perfect for wine lovers. The first is across La Rioja on the French Way. As the most prestigious winemaking region in Spain, La Rioja is the most obvious choice for wine lovers. The region is located on the famous French Way and its capital, Le Grogno, is home to a fantastic harvest festival at the end of September called Fiesta de la Vendimia. Number two is El Bierzo on the French Way. Home to delicious Mencia red wines, El Bierzo is another fantastic destination for wine lovers on the French Way. Aside from its wine, the area also has a fascinating history. The Templars built a castle in the area's capital, Ponferrada, to protect pilgrims who were walking the Camino de Santiago. You can still explore Castillo de los Templarios today. Number three on the list is Porto on the Portuguese Way. As the home of port wine and the capital of the famous Douro region, which is known for producing high quality wines, Porto is a wine lover's paradise. It is also a UNESCO World Heritage listed city, which makes it an ideal destination for experiencing wonderful Portuguese culture and architecture. Number four is Alberino in the Rias Baixas in, on the Portuguese Way. The Rias Baixas area is on both the Portuguese Way and the Portuguese Coastal Way and is home to fruity Alberino white wines. The Portuguese version of this wine, Alberino or Vino Verde, is also produced south of the River Minho in northern Portugal. The best time to visit this region is from mid-September, as that is when the harvest takes place, during which there is a fantastic harvest festival in the town of Orozal. At number 5 is Bordeaux on the Camino from Paris to Tours. Bordeaux is undoubtedly one of the most well-known names on this list and is the largest wine-growing region in France. Although the area celebrates its wine festival ahead of the harvest season in June, autumn is still a fantastic time to visit as walkers are able to witness the harvest and attend open house events in the region's wineries. Number 6 is Champagne on the Via Francigena. With the area home to one of the world's most famous drinks, Champagne in northern France is a fantastic destination to visit during harvest time. The region is located on the path of the Via Francigena, the Camino to Rome, and hosts a Chauchelet festival at the end of harvest time. Massif de Saint-Thierry, north of Reims, also hosts a traditional harvest festival at the end of October, which is well worth a visit. At number 7 is Burgundy and Beaujolais on the Cluny Way. This route is one of the most traditional Camino de Santiago routes in France. The path crosses through world-famous wine-producing regions including Burgundy, an area renowned for its red wine made from Pinot Noir grapes. Another delicious local wine to the area is Beaujolais, which is a, defin a definite must-try for any wine lover. Number 8 is Chianti in Tuscany and Val d'Orchia. Chianti on the Via Francigena is one of the best and most well-known Italian wine-producing regions with a number of delicious wines that come from the area. Val d'Orchia is another fantastic wine region on the Via Francigena, which has also been named as a UNESCO World Heritage Site thanks to its beautiful landscape and charming villages. Finally, at number 9 is the Terrace Vineyards of Lake Geneva on the Via Francigena. This section of the Via Francigena takes walkers along the scenic Lake Geneva. Following this, they will be able to admire the Terrace Vineyards of La Vaux, a UNESCO World listed heritage site, and experience the beauty of the lakeside towns of Vevey and Montreux. Those who walk this route at the end of September will also be able to experience a fantastic three-day wine festival in the town of Lutry, where they can visit wine vaults and cellars. So prices start from 480 euros per person sharing for six nights on section two of the French Way from Pamplona to Logroño in high season, which is September to October. 679 euros per person sharing for six nights on the Via Francigena, walking from San Miniato to Siena. And if you book two months in advance, you will get 5% off. The price includes half board accommodation as standard, luggage transfer on hotel to hotel, holiday pack with walking notes and practical information. It does not include flights, insurance or airport transfers. So start planning your Camino trip today by logging on to www.caminoways.com or calling plus 353 1525 2886. Thank you.